Hey guys, welcome back to another Tech Tuesday. Now today's video isn't really planned, it kind of just came to me last night and that is because of an email that I received. Now you probably have been getting a lot of emails recently from companies saying that the laws are changing and that you have to press this button if you want to stay subscribed to their newsletters about emails. And I've been getting a lot of these recently myself so I kind of have been ignoring them, part of the companies I actually really want to stay in touch with. Until last night when a certain email I got really <laughs> really caught my eye. I remember sitting there and I was scrolling through emails and I remember thinking, what the hell is this? I had an email from a website saying I'd be deleting my account in 10 days. Now, a problem with this is that I didn't actually recognise the website at all, but apparently I had messages on the website and a lot of you to reply to these people. And I have had these emails before and on websites I never even signed up for in the first place. A little bit of digging, it turns out I do have a account on this website. I don't even ever remember making. So one thing I did neglect to mention, is that this is actually a dating site. I don't ever remember signing up for it, but apparently I did. So today's video is going to be me exploring the site and seeing what it does. So let's begin. <laughs> okay, so first I want to go straight to was my actual profile. Now, my location we're gonna blur out because I don't live in Harefield. I don't even live close to Harefield. So don't worry about you guys tracking me down in any way. So I'm not gonna bother hiding the location. But what I think it has also done is actually updated my age to the age I am now. And uh, yeah, before you ask, that really is my age. So we're going on to the actual um, picture now. I've just noticed a picture. So if you guys can see that, just in case you can't. I'm wearing a very sexy black and white jumper and doing a very sexy pose. That was, that was a joke. I remember this picture being taken. It was taken in 100 Acre Woods where the Winnie the Pooh films and books are set. Anyway, so moving on to bio, I said, my name is Becky and I am 18 years old. Why was I not put down at birth? Anyway, and I live in England. If anyone needs any advice or just wants to ask me questions, feel free. That's really cringy, but it doesn't sound like the kind of thing I put on a dating site. If you're involved, send me abuse or something really personal, and it cuts off, so I've no idea what I was trying to say there. Yeah, you can answer questions that you can put on your profile if you want to, and you can actually add more pictures. You edit your profile info, and mine is 21st of December. Zodiac sign, Sagittarius. Now another fun fact, I always like to put fun facts in my videos. I'm actually like half Sagittarius, half Capricorn, so there are some magazines and some certain horoscope type things. Might say I'm a Capricorn because of the day I was born. Most things put me down as Sagittarius because I was born on 21st of December. And Capricorn tends to start on 22nd of December, but some do say it starts on 21st of December. So sometimes I'm Capricorn, sometimes Sagittarius. So fun fact for you, I don't even know what birth sign I am, to be honest. <laughs> Preferred language English and nice status, I'm single. I didn't bother answering any of the other stuff. Now I'm going to go into my messages now. I actually have messages apparently. Somebody actually messaged me and I look like that in my pictures. So <laughs> can't do it too badly. So the first person said, hello, how are you? Let's communicate. Thank you. Well, at least he was polite. I'll give him that. Another guy said, I bet you get tons of messages. You look amazing. Two out of 17. Is that meant to be a rating on my appearance? Because if so, I'm actually quite offended. Next guy said, just wanted to meet people here. I'm an extroverted individual, easy going, genuine from Portugal, but living in Boston, we'd like to chat. Again, that's actually not too bad, it's quite polite. So the last one said, hello, I want a woman who'd be my friend, lover, and my wife. Does this mean I'm now engaged? Because I don't have the money for a wedding right now. <laughs> also, I don't know when he sent this, so I could have been engaged for quite a long time without realizing. I don't know what to do right now. I've also apparently got 17 notifications, but I can't look at any of them, so you have to have premium to see who's liked you and who's viewed your profile. I was gonna quickly look at the globe icon to see all the people you can match with. I was gonna blow all these people out for privacy reasons. So this is a lot like Tinder, in the sense of it's got like the same kind of layout. Not that I use Tinder, it's just that I know the layout is a very popular dating site. All my friends use it, so I see it a lot, so I know what it looks like. That's it, I promise. One thing I did notice though is you can just message people outright without actually having to match with them first. This probably is why all those people messaged me in the first place. Again, there is an age thing. It looks like I have already set it, so I have clearly been on this website a while ago, which is really, really embarrassing. Now, I think I know what's happened here. What this is, is 
I used to be a site called spring.me which I was on when I was 18 and it's basically just like Ask FM and Curious Cat people ask you questions and then you answer them but um, in the email title it says something about it being spring.me as well as Twu so I just realised that spring.me has become a dating site so if you have a girlfriend or boyfriend and used to be on spring.me and I don't want you guys to get into trouble so please make sure you actually check and make sure you're not actually on the site anymore because otherwise your profile will automatically be transferred into a dating site without even letting you know first. So I just wanted you to let you guys know to check and if you do get an email talking about you being the dating site that I ever remember signing up for make sure you actually check it first because it might actually be legit. So let's try to help couples not break up because if they find out we're on this site hopefully, hopefully you'll just delete it. Now I'm going to be doing the same thing I'm going to be deleting it myself it's, I never asked be on that site in the first place but this is just a word of warning as well as a really fun video so i hope you guys all enjoyed that and don't forget if you like my content please don't forget to subscribe and press the bell button down below to notify of all weekly uploads and i'm now off to work in my i'm actually already wearing my uniform because i'm literally about to go to work any minute i just want to get good lighting for this video and try and save some money for this apparent wedding i'm about to be having so <laughs> i'll see you guys in the next video bye